Hello everyone and welcome to the Autopedia channel. Today, we're putting two heavyweights in the compact SUV segment head-to-head, -head, the 2025 Kia Sportage and the all-new 2025 Volkswagen Tiguan. Which of these stylish and tech-packed SUVs deserves your hard-earned cash? Stay with us as we break it all down, from design to performance, tech to value. And at the end, we'll share three reasons to buy and three reasons to skip each. And don't forget to comment below with the SUVs you'd like us to compare next. Exterior design and dimensions. Let's start with first impressions, and both SUVs know how to make one. The 2025 Kia Sportage, sporting Kia's Opposites United design philosophy, blends bold, futuristic styling with rugged elements. The signature LED star map lighting and distinctive amber DRLs make it stand out in traffic. The Sportage also offers options like a two-tone roof and wheels up to 19 inches in size, ensuring you can customize its bold personality. Now let's look at the Volkswagen Tiguan. Redesigned from the ground up, this SUV introduces a sleeker, more athletic look thanks to its MQB Evo platform. Slimmer headlights, an available LED light bar, and aerodynamic features like a rear spoiler and air curtains give it a modern edge. With wheel options ranging from 17 to 20 inches and vibrant new colors like Monterey Blue Pearl, the Tiguan brings European flair to the table. In terms of dimensions, the Sportage offers a bit more ground clearance at 8.3 inches, making it better suited for light off-roading, while the Tiguan's slightly longer length at 182 inches ensures a spacious cabin and cargo area. Interior features, technology, and infotainment. Step inside the Sportage and you're greeted by a cabin designed to wow. Kia has equipped it with dual 12.3-inch panoramic displays as standard, blending the digital gauge cluster with the infotainment system for a sleek, unified look. Wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto come standard, and higher trims add a 10-inch head-up display and a Harman Kardon premium audio system. Over in the Tiguan, Volkswagen has also upped its game. The Digital Cockpit Pro comes standard with a 10.25-inch display, but the real star is the available 15-inch infotainment screen, the largest in its class. Like the Sportage, it offers wireless connectivity, but it also introduces innovative features like atmospheres, which combine ambient lighting and audio settings to create a tailored cabin vibe. In terms of material quality, the Tiguan takes a slight edge with genuine wood accents, quilted leather seats, and massaging front seats on higher trims. The Sportage, however, shines with practical touches like a dual-level cargo floor and wireless charging pad neatly integrated into the center console. Boot volume. When it comes to cargo, the Sportage takes the lead with 39.6 cubic feet of space behind the second row and up to 74.1 cubic feet with the seats folded, it's among the most spacious in its class. The Taiguan, while slightly behind, still impresses. Its cargo area offers 38.5 cubic feet behind the second row and expands to 73 cubic feet when the seats are down. For most families, both SUVs deliver plenty of space for groceries, gear, and weekend getaways. Powertrains and performance. Under the hood, the Kia Sportage offers a versatile lineup. The base model features a 2.5-liter engine with 187 horsepower, but eco-conscious buyers will love the hybrid and plug-in hybrid options offering up to 268 horsepower and excellent fuel efficiency. All-wheel drive models also come with a terrain mode for snow, mud, and sand. The Volkswagen Tiguan, meanwhile, sticks with a single engine choice, a turbocharged 2.0-liter four-cylinder, now delivering 201 horsepower, a welcome improvement over last year. Thanks to its weight reduction of 170 pounds, the Tiguan feels nimble and responsive, especially on highways. For towing, 
The Sportage edges out slightly with a maximum capacity of 3,500 pounds, compared to the Tiguan's 2,200 pounds. Safety and crash test results. Safety is a priority for both SUVs, but let's see how they stack up. The Sportage comes equipped with a suite of advanced driver assistance systems, like forward collision avoidance with oncoming detection, highway driving assist, and a 360-degree camera system. The Tiguan counters with Volkswagen's IQ Drive suite, which includes level two semi-automated driving, adaptive control with stop and go, and new rear side airbags, bringing its total to 10 airbags. Both SUVs are expected to earn top marks in crash tests from the IIHS and NETSA. Pricing and value. Pricing for the 2025 Kia Sportage starts at an estimated $27,000 for the base LX trim and goes up to over $42,000 for the fully loaded X-Pro Prestige. Considering its range of powertrains and features, the Sportage delivers excellent value. The Volkswagen Tiguan, with a slightly higher starting price of around $31,000, offers a premium feel right out of the gate. Top trims like the SEL R-Line push the price closer to $45,000, catering to buyers seeking a refined, tech-forward experience. Both the 2025 Kia Sportage and the 2025 Volkswagen Tiguan are exceptional compact SUVs, each catering to unique preferences and priorities. The Kia Sportage shines for those who value versatility, offering a diverse range of powertrain options, including hybrid and plug-in hybrid models, and delivering generous cargo space paired with excellent rear legroom. Its advanced technology features, such as the dual panoramic displays and the convenience of a digital key, further enhance its appeal as a practical and innovative choice. On the other hand, the Volkswagen Tiguan leans into a more premium experience, boasting refined interior materials that exude sophistication and luxury. Its standout 15-inch infotainment screen brings cutting-edge features to the forefront, creating a tech-forward environment for drivers and passengers alike. Additionally, the Tiguan's lighter build not only contributes to improved handling, but also enhances its overall performance, making it a compelling option for those who prioritize a dynamic driving experience. Ultimately, whether you gravitate toward the Sportage's practicality and tech savviness, or the Tiguan's upscale finishes and advanced features, both SUVs have plenty to offer in their own distinctive ways. Let us know in the comments which one you'd choose and why. Stay tuned to our channel for more updates on the latest automotive innovations and let us know your thoughts on our video in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to keep up with the future of driving. Until next time, drive safe and dream big.